Hey guys, it's me, LegoMaster627, and welcome back to Zola's Lap 2. Yes, I know, we're actually filming it on the, you know, a uh, proper day this time. And frick me, my skin looks different again. Yeah, apparently I was affected outside of Lego's Island again. I need to get that fixed somehow. I tried earlier, nothing worked. What am I gonna do? Oh, that better get fixed soon. I've not had my skin for six months now, which is just annoying. At least not on my end. Like, if you go to Lego's Island, it should it should appear. You we tested that before, ain't we right? Um, but the point is, yeah, it changed again. I'll probably have to go into the launcher and try and change it again. But for now, enough about that. Yeah, uh, surprise. It's actually more than just the construction today. Now, what I said in that update video was actually all I was doing for the construction until a certain someone right here requested me to make a mini event based off of well can you please explain to the viewers yeah I think like if you speak loud enough they should be able to hear you Basically, yeah, she basically graduated college. Now, of course, the official, actual college graduation is maybe, like, another two years away. From, like, officially, officially graduating college. Are we right? Basically, yeah. That's what we're doing here. And, well, as you can see, it is nighttime again. Well, almost. Next time on the 15th, uh, it'll be fully nighttime, and by then, a uh, Christmas event begins. Which is awesome, so we're a week away. But, we have something here to uh, keep us distracted. Oh, and yes, I will get to all this construction later. As that was technically the main update of the day. Now... She requested me to make a mini event, uh, many hours after I uploaded that update video. Uh, because this is huge as heck, she asked me to make a mini event. And, uh, I threw together a two-room mini event, coinciding out here and in the lab office. But first, before we can jump into that, let's take a look at our advent calendar. We have the ominous banner for December 4th, the spruce sapling for December 5th, the ender pearl for December 6th, the uh, goat horn, uh, and this would be who knew I had to put that in? And lastly, um, let's actually, oh my god! First off, um, I already have these archived in the chest, so uh, I don't need to worry. I have actually all these items in the chest, so I don't need to worry. The last item, December 8th, is the firework rocket. However, it's actually duration free, so watch when we fire it. Yeah, it's going to shoot more fireworks. And that's a perfect way to celebrate this, aren't we? Yeah, her uh, skin, at least on my end, got messed up. Don't worry, she still has her actual skin. It's just on my end. Yeah, you can bet what happened. Dang, man, I really hope that gets resolved soon, man. Half a year without my skin, that actually really sucks. Anyway, again, enough about that. Let's officially get into the graduation party. As you guys can see, the front of the lab is decorated. We have a huge P, uh, a huge uh, PHSC sign, which uh, you may explain what that means, right? I do know what it means, but you may want to explain it better. Yep, that is exactly what that sign represents. Oh yes, and for the first time ever, there are exclusive items 
for the each of us. For the both of us, that's what I meant to say. There are exclusive items that only Rose Crystal can collect, and I can't. For example, she can only collect the graduation gown, which I am going to hopefully uh, make copies of these. So let me just do that real quick. Let me just archive these. Okay, so that's the only time I can do that. All other times, yeah, only Rose Crystal is able to collect them. I was only collecting them for archive purposes, and also before you did that. Yep, I purposely did that for archive purposes. How do we look? Collect the other item. Don't worry, I already have these in a chest. For uh, memory's sake, so we never forget these items. How do we look? To this. Now, hold on. There's one more thing. Notice up there, and this is the first item that I can actually collect. The PHSC graduation hat. Let's put it on. And now, we're all both able to actually enter this now. Don't worry, I have archives. And just items of this hat. I know, I know. Hers has got messed up too, at least on my end. But, yeah. Anyway, oh, yeah, by the way, this is a one-day mini event that only lasts the one day of December 8th. And then on the 9th, I'm going to come back here and clean all this up. Which shouldn't take long, considering it is a really small party. Speaking of which, it is finally time to get into the main part, which is going inside. Basically, Rose Crystal can only enter if both gown items are on. Since both of them are on, we can both enter the room. Well, I could enter the room at any time. Now, this room is a replica, or AKA, a uh, quote unquote. <coughs> Also, let me uh, take this for archive purposes. Uh, let me just explain that real quick. Yeah, let me just take that for archive purposes. Because I need to keep that in a chest at some point. But um, this room is actually a remake of the exact room the graduation ceremony was actually held in. We right? This is literally a remake of the exact room that it was held in. Obviously, we can't be 100% accurate here. No, 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 dude. That would be way too godforsaken difficult. And especially on my end. One thing I do remember, though, was there being an American flag up there. God dang it. And it was sideways. So even if we tried to do it in the game, that wouldn't do anything. So the point remains, guys. Basically, what this is, is basically the uh, degree she got. It is the associate's art degree, because that's the diploma she got. So that's really cool. We can technically both collect this item, but it's more useful towards you. With that being said, what are your thoughts on the room, by the way? Um, and just to be clear, this was all last minute. I was not planning at all. To make a mini event based off of this at all. I'm not even joking. This was never planned. At all. It was just going to be the Christmas construction. And then that would be literally it. That was literally the only thing I was planning to do for December 8th's updates. But then you asked me to make this. I honestly had a fun time making it. I'm not going to lie. Despite it only being a two-room event, and yes, you are still able to actually get down to the lab itself. Um, yeah, you're still able to get down there. Um, but there's nothing down there, except for the fact that, well, there is no new updates down here. But, we still have this reminding us that we are a week away until donations begin, aka the Christmas event. Now that we got the graduation party out of the way... Let's finally tour some construction, and there actually aren't that many rooms, but I actually forgot to mention what these banners are. The PHSC graduation banner. Now, both of us can collect this item. Now, you can just click on one of the four banners in this room to collect it. Without further ado, um, Rose Crystal, you mind uh, coming with me again? To tour some construction real quick. This shouldn't take long considering there's only maybe like two or three rooms. <coughs> or uh, more. I don't know. But point is, 
now that we got that part out of the way, as you can see, we have a huge graduation part. No, sorry, that was already over. Uh, the construction for the Christmas event in a week. Uh, yeah, you may notice it has also already started snowing around here. Similarly to last year, the one difference is that there's, first off, the lighting is a lot brighter to make it, you know, uh, not the same. Also, there is a crate which is potentially filled with snow. And no, this Christmas event's not going to be a copy and paste of last year. Oh, no, God, no. Trust me, I got a lot of stuff planned. And uh, you should be there, by the way, when it releases, by the way. It would be nice to tour that party together. What do you think? We should uh, tour that Christmas event together when it um, comes out. Don't worry, that's a week away because we have a lot of time to prepare for that. But yeah, there is literally snow everywhere on the outside. So that's really awesome. And even on the tree too. Which is pretty sweet. Alright guys, uh, what else do we got? Uh, right, the roof has some snow, which is pretty sweet. Yep, the roof has some snow, preparating us for the upcoming event. Which is going to be really cool. It's going to be nice to see what I actually do for uh, the Christmas event. It's going to be a, hopefully a really good event. The last, like, seven were honestly really awesome. Uh, I think there's only, actually, only one more room. And that's the flower shop. So if we go up to the flower shape, uh, sorry, a uh, flower shop, but speaking of, yeah, there's flower shape. At least she's back in her regular color now after the future party. But yeah. Christmas workshop, of course, reopens on the 15th of December. Well, the date's different every single year, of course. Last year was December 16th. But, um, yep, as you can see, we have construction all over the flower shop for the workshop. For the Christmas workshop because as usual that is tradition to bring back every single year um, for this um, Christmas event and as we all know last year we finally got these godforsaken chests to actually move which was really nice who knows maybe again this year and maybe we might visit Santa Sheep's home again that would be really cool if we could do that again I feel that's probably gonna happen we have the little carpet that's normally in here um, just parts of it. Outside of that, that is it for the entire construction. Um, genuinely put though, that I think is actually it for this entire video. I'm trying to see if there's anything else before I clarify that we're done. Uh, you can come back out here now. Yeah, yeah, you can come back out here. So we'll see you all in the next episode on December 15th when the Christmas event releases. Hopefully I can actually get it out on the actual day for once, unlike last year. I filmed it on the right day, but I didn't actually get it out on the right day. Maybe for once, I might actually film it before like, you know, uh, 10 p.m. last year. Yeah, I rewatched the video, and yeah, I filmed it at like nearly 11 p.m. at the time last year. Please, let's hope that's not a thing this year. That would be awesome. Alright, no, seriously though, guys. See you all in the next episode. Also, sorry that there wasn't much construction. Uh, I was mainly focusing on this party, as you can clearly tell. And, um, well, that's it. See you next time, guys.